Hello sweet lovely family members. You're welcome to things to know about Africa. Here in Ghana, in the greater Accra region is a day that marks the celebration Chalawoti festival. To keep watching my videos kindly subscribe to my channel and keep motivated. The Chalawoti Street Art Festival also known as Chalawoti is an alternative platform that brings art, music, dance and performance out into the streets. The festival targets exchanges between scores of local and international artists and patrons by creating and appreciating art together. Since 2011, Chalawoti has included street painting, graffiti murals, photography, theater, spoken word, interactive art installations, live street performances, extreme sports, film shows, a fashion parade, a music block party, recyclable design workshops and much more. It is the first to be organized in Accra, Ghana and has inspired similar events across the country. There have been six editions so far. The first two ran for one day each, while the 2013 and 2014 edition ran concurrently for two days, the former in September and the latter in August, a week after. The Homo Woe Festival of the Ga People at the historical Jamestown, Ghana on the High Street in Accra. The format switched in 2016 when the festival lasted an entire week, from August 18th to 21st. This switch saw the festival hop from the open street gallery that is Jamestown to other art spaces, such as the Nubuque Foundation, the Museum of Science and Technology as well as film screenings at the Move and Pick Ambassador Hotel. The same format will be replicated in the 7th edition, themed, Watamata with further immersion into Accra, spreading to areas such as Nima, Osu and more. The event is produced by Alt Radio, with support from other local cultural networks like Atukwai Art Foundation, Foundation for Contemporary Art Ghana, Dr. Monk, Red Cat Pictures and the Institute for Ney in Ghana. List of activities during the street festival, photo exhibitions, street painting, graffiti, murals, interactive installations, street boxing, movie screening, procession of cultures, design labs, movie screenings. The program guide to this year's Chala Wo Ti Wo Street Art Festival provides you with the details to every outlined activity, where to find them and at what time. The producers of the community-based FT, Alt, started Chale Wo in 2010 as a street art exhibition and food fair in Mansak Bona, Jamestown. The festival has since grown to be a city-wide phenomenon that attracts about 45,000 people every year, who come together to watch live music music and art performances. In 2015, the festival introduced themes, starting with African electronics, which was imagined and inspired by the indigenous esoteric knowledge that Ghanaians used to create the impossible. It was a way to look at the transformative natural power that allows Ghanaians to learn, grow and develop. Spirit Robot 2016 and Watamata 2017 sought to symbolize the way in which Africans from all over the world share knowledge. The theme of 2018, Para Other, addressed issues of identity, citizenship and belonging. Chala Woti has been the launch pad for many Ghanaian artists, such as Ibrahim Mahama and Serge Atukwai. Ghanaian collective Nima Muhin Manchi Art has been responsible for creating the colorful festival murals on the walls of Jamestown, featuring local artists, such as Tedaboden Kali, Mo Wudu, Nika Weo and Kamal Shabaleri. The Accra based group is famous for its avant garde style. For the 2018 theme, it joined forces with two time Chala Woti muralist Babara Sibinlist Argentina, Justina Jabas Vesca Poland, and Amina Gimba Nigeria and Komi Olaf Nigeria to create a collaborative mural. This is characteristic of a festival that seeks to foster collaboration and the exchange of ideas between Ghanaian and foreign artists said Chale Wot's producer, Jerome Lutterer. A major aspect of the festival and a favorite with participants is the labs, in which filmmakers and other visual and performing artists host discussions about their work and life. The labs is also a cinema, screening independently produced films, including Tuko Macho, produced by Kenya's Nest Collective and Lucky produced by Ghana's Abstract, and it hosted the film and television program from the University of the Witwatersrand in Johannesburg in 2018. Chale Wot Festival Accra Gan. Performance art has also been an unmissable highlight of West Africa's largest street art festival. Queen Bofo and Va Benefiazzi of Ghana, Cleo Lake of the UK and the Ayanda Sioka of South Africa have performed for audiences over the years. Ghanaian British artist Leslie Asari gave one of the standout performances of Chale Wot 2018 with her Body Arcana, which was staged at the Old Usher Fort Church. Performance art has also been an unmissable highlight of West Africa's largest street art festival. Queen Bofo and Va Benefiazzi of Ghana, 
Cleo Lake of the UK and the Ayanda Sioka of South Africa have performed for audiences over the years. Ghanaian British artist Leslie Asari gave one of the standout performances of Chala Woti 2018 with her Body Arcana, which was staged at the Old Usher Fort Church, Chile WOT Festival Accra, Ghana. During the 2018 edition, Ga Blues rock band Ozzy and the others shared the Sabale radio music stage with Yell, Stevo and the Alasmen, the Wazumbians and Teshi Boy. Chala Woti is now recognized as a hitmaker on the Ghanaian music scene, primarily because of its role in propelling alternative and indie musicians into the mainstream. Women DJs, including Nigeria's Sensei Lo, South Africa's Bujin, Ghana's Michi and London-based Chukle Tan, have also dominated the stage. For many years during Chala Woti, High Street has become known as the space to exhibit wild and wonderful fashion. Designers and creators use the festival as an opportunity to show their creations. A range of local fabrics, styles and accessories are also on sale at the crafts market. Since the late 1970s boxing has been a big part of the Jamestown community, churning out several world champions, and during the Chael Wote weekend, public boxing matches are held in front of the Wado building. Bodybuilders parade around the festival and have become one of the most popular attractions. The stunts and crashes of extreme sports have also been a very significant feature of Chala Woti, courtesy of legendary Ghanaian stuntman Martin Ablakwa and the Prince. At the 2017 Labs, Martin Ablakwa explained, It brings me joy to see a smile of amazement and amusement on a child's face when I do something deemed impossible. The Chala Woti Street Art Festival is giving a new and louder voice to Ghanaian creatives and breathing new life into Jamestown by providing jobs for more than 100 people in the district. On this cultural and historical tour, you will see the former slave castle at Cape Coast and receive your African name at a traditional ceremony. Shop at the Makola Market, bathe in Bodhi Falls, create authentic fabric in your Dinkra cloth stamping class and take a breathtaking walk across the rainforest Cockham Canopy. Towards the end of your trip, experience the Chael Wo Arts Festival and close with a few relaxing trips to Accra's beaches. It's time to go back to Africa. It's time to go home. This is definitely a trip that you don't want to miss. Chael Wo is now recognized as a hitmaker on the Ghanaian music scene, primarily because of its role in propelling alternative and indie musicians into the mainstream, women DJs, including Nigeria's Sensei Lo, South Africa's Bujin, Ghana's Michi and London-based Chuk Leiden, have also dominated the stag. Chala Woti Festival is also a form of exhibiting different kinds of artworks, materials, food, history, drawings and many more. Different kinds of people from different country and also around the globe witness this occasion. This is me. My name is Elegant, and I'm repping life at Cha Ali Woti Festival. It's so much fun. You'll meet different kinds of peoples, food, arts, works, and many more. Everybody is busy displaying their creative talent for people to watch. Both kids and adults is so much fun.
you're watching things to know about Africa and repping in Ghana. This is the end of the videos and I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time on my next video. Kindly subscribe to my channel to keep motivated. See you. Bye.